Hey, howdy, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. This is this week's Patreon winner, unprocessed and everything in between. So let's get into this. This is another band I haven't heard, another album I have no, I know nothing about. Let's go unprocessed and everything in between. Okay. Yep. Yep. It's going to be heavy. Interesting. Whoa. Ooh. That's a big tone. It's very much sugar. This is a really thick mix. Yo, <laughs> this is sick. This is kind of like Polyphia or, or uh, Animals as Leaders. Oh, <laughs> let's go. This is good. Is that, is that right? Close enough. This is a really unique sound overall. Ooh, breakdown time. This is about to be disgusting. What? This is insane. Back to the chorus. Okay, 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 okay. I need to hear that again. Um, that that's an amazing first track. I I love this already so much. Great chorus. Great chunky tone. Great sort of song structure, really interesting blend of like EDM electronic stuff in here. The tone reminds me of Meshuggah a little bit sometimes. All right, let me hear this. Let's transition again. I, I'm loving everything about this so far. This switch up was God tier. <laughs> it's so groovy it's so groovy this is crazy how low tuned are these guitars man the bass is incredible oh, wow is this all bass? Does this group even have a guitarist? Is this, it's just all bass. I initially thought it might just be really down-tuned guitars, but I think it's just all bass. Now, I, I guess they do have a guitarist. It's very low, though. Bass is almost featuring more than the guitar is. This is the grooviest metal I've heard in a long time. They really put the ah in the lyrics. I'm very impressed so far. Let's see how the rest of the album plays out. How many tracks we got? Nine tracks. Oh, speaking of Polyphia, a Tim Henson on that one. It's very Polyphia.
The little synth electronic stuff really makes it stand out. <laughs> this is insane! Unprocessed? I can't process what's happening. Bum, bum, bum. It's so... It's so bass heavy. What? What in the world is this? <laughs> They're just trying to pull out the wildest noises they can. Ooh! This is insane! <laughs> Wow! I love this. This is incredible. This is so unique. It's the, it's really just all of these elements together that make it so interesting. Every track so far has felt different from the last. They haven't felt the same. Polyphia, but heavier with lyrics. Featuring the bass above the guitar is insane. Such a good choice. It's either a bass or like an extremely down-tuned guitar. Good chorus. Bliffy wouldn't do this. This is Meshuggah. Is this Bleed 2? Alright, here's the one with... Tim Henson. Oh, Scott LePage is Polyphia too, okay. Did we just get an ARF ARF? Little Polyphia solo. This feels like if Polyphia unlocked their true potential, that's what this band feels like. I love that all the songs feel so unique. Like, there hasn't been one song where I'm like, oh, this feels like the other ones. Like, no, they each have some part about it that gives it its own unique identity. Like this part with the, the beautiful little harmonics going on here. Ooh. I love this perpetual motion guitar thing going on in the background. With the little harmonic thingies. This is like a ballad track, almost. Oh. That's so low! Again, a simple chorus, but it's really effective. everything about this album so far. <laughs> There's not one single thing I dislike. I love that. That's so good. I think I'm off on the chords or something. They use that fifth jump. I always praise fifth jumps. Oh no. Are we about to pop off? Ooh. Huh? You talk to me when I was fragile To focus Don't don't Whoa! That song was a little... A little bit 
not not bad, but it's a little bit more forgettable than the other ones. I think that might be my least favorite song of the album so far. But every other one has been a banger. Let's see how this final track goes. Oh, there's the title. Come on, this this has to go so hard. It's the outro track. Oh, it's so groovy. Oh, oh, oh. oh, this works really well as an outro track. Wow. <laughs> I'm so glad I heard that. I've heard a lot of praise for this album, and yeah, it's, it's warranted. That was amazing. I think the best part about it is just the uniqueness of their sound. I don't know much else to say, honestly. It's just an extremely solid record. I don't think it's a 10 out of 10 masterpiece, but it's up there. 